you lovely people welcome back to my channel for another edition of a tudor mint and a video game and this time guys we've got a really fantastic one just look at this absolutely gorgeous piece here it's called the sleeping wizard and as you can see there is a little dragon on the here as well a huge austrian crystal in the tree Oh, th this is absolutely fantastic, guys. Just look at it. Beautiful, beautiful piece. And um, let's turn it round like we usually do. There we go. So you can see it all the way around. And then, of course, we'll take a look in closer detail in just a second. Let's push them up a bit so you can see it all. There we go. This is absolutely gorgeous, guys. Even the detail on the base itself is just incredible obviously like i said we'll take a closer look at the uh, finer details in a sec but you can see there guys the back of the tree and everything is just beautiful so he's in a hammock the old wizard having a nap and the dragons hanging over him looking at him but yeah this this is just absolutely beautiful it's tudor mint at their best again just wonderful, wonderful Tudor Mint. But you can see his beard there and everything as well. All the little bits of branches coming off. Oh, just absolutely gorgeous. But of course, it's that crystal, guys, that makes it. So, oh, eye-catching it really, really is. I mean, they're sculpted to perfection, always by a said uh, artist. And yeah, they're, they're just absolutely staggering. But this one has just got such a quality of its own. It really, really has. And it is literally one of my favourite pieces. Once again, I say that all the time, but it is. It's one of my favourite pieces that I own because of the detail that's there. Beautiful. So let's take a look around it. Let's go up to that Austrian crystal first because that's the biggest eye catcher. Look at that when the light hits him. Absolutely fantastic. The detail on the tree as well is just incredible. There's the wizard himself. Let's get him in there so you can see his face a bit. There we go. His beard, the detail on his beard is incredible. His robes and even the hammock itself, the detail of the rope is incredible. And then that dragon, guys, look at him. He's gorgeous. It looks like he's a baby dragon. There's his uh, his wings there. And of course the other tree as well. The detail there is incredible as well. Round to the dragon's face from the front there. You can just about probably make that out. Yeah, this is stunning guys. And then like I said, look at that. He's got some kind of little cup there. And uh, look, it's like stone and other bits and bobs uh, all over the bottom of it here. Yeah, th th this is an absolutely stunning piece. Look at it, beautiful, his feet there. <laughs> it's just incredible, the detail on his robe. Once again, a wizard with just fantastic detail everywhere. Now let's turn it round. And you can see here, guys, more of the dragon, his tail coming down there. Different angle on his wings, his claws. The detail again in the tree is incredible. You can see more of the uh, wizard's beard there casting down over his shoulder. 
More details on his robe as well. You can see some triangles at the bottom there. And oh, just, just, just absolutely fantastic. Then all these bits here, guys, like a mushroom there. Oh, just, just absolutely staggering. Look at it. The detail of the roots of the tree. This is one absolutely stunning piece. Wow. And the other tree again from that angle there. Yeah, he is gorgeous. And let's have a look at the bottom of him. Oh, let's turn it around the right way first. There we go. So there we go, guys. It is actually the snoozing wizard. So I said that wrong when I said uh, the sleeping wizard. It's the snoozing wizard. And it's by Mark Locker again. So yeah, absolutely beautiful piece there. It is a 3149. Gorgeous, gorgeous thing that it is. Yep, absolutely gorgeous. And when you look at it from the front again like that, guys, how stunning is that? When the light hits that Austrian crystal, it is quite, quite stunning. So yeah, the detail is amazing. Let's turn it around again, guys. Let's go all the way around again. So yeah, what a stunning piece by the wonderful, wonderful Tudor Mint. Like I said, one of my favourites in my collection. Just an absolute stunner. Quite hard to keep in the camera. But there we go. There's his face again, look, as he's having his snooze. But of course, guys, as usual, there is another part to this, isn't there? There certainly is. We've got to take a look at a video game, of course, that features a wizard so yeah, I've got an absolute stunner for you this time, guys. As you are about to find out, once again, I'm not going to say it right now. But you'll soon know if you carry on watching this video. Right, I think it's time that I showed you this absolutely awesome game.
spesial. Ectolume. 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 Well, there you go, guys. In Virtus Verbus. Oh my God, is that a game and a half? What a beautiful, beautiful game that is. Stunning from the graphics to the gameplay. Obviously, you play a wizard. He's wandering around all the different realms, performing his wizardry, isn't he? Hmm. Absolutely stunning. Um, just so well made and it's been around for quite some time guys so if you haven't played it already jump on it guys jump on it because you will not regret it it is one stunning stunning game nearly as stunning as this beauty here yeah absolutely beautiful um again guys tudor mint at their best just look at it it is beautiful as we give it another spin um, yeah, have you played that game, guys? Have you played it in the past? Do you still play it now? That is the big question on the game there. Certainly uh, worth a go if you haven't. 
and worth revisiting if you have. Apparently there's been some more bits and bobs added over time as well that you may have missed out on, some DLC and what have you. So yeah, whoa. back to this beauty guys. Absolutely stunning, like I said. There we go, we'll take another quick look at it around like that. Brilliant, there's his face. Back underneath, guys. See, I'm doing it the wrong way around again, guys. I just kind of got it. Oh, no, I had it the right way around. See, I'm blind as a bat. But that's why you're here, because I'm so pippin' stupid. But yeah, there we go. The snoozing wizard, even though I called him the sleeping wizard earlier. But yeah, what an absolute beauty. And it's so heavy, guys. So heavy, you wouldn't believe. But it's a beauty, that's for sure. Especially when you have him like that. He looks even more stunning because you can see the dragon properly. And then of course him. Lazy Bones having a good sleep. But there you go guys. Another edition and done and dusted. What do you think of this piece guys? Have you got it in your Tudor Mint collection? Have you owned it in the past? Would you love to pick this one up? Because I'll tell you what, you won't regret it. Well, yeah, it's gorgeous. Especially that big Austrian crystal there. Yeah, and that game guys. Have you played it? Like I said, you know what to do, guys. Comment below with any of your thoughts because I love reading your comments. Oh, God, it's just gorgeous, guys. This one is gorgeous. I love it, love it, love it to bits. Right, and with that, guys, I'm going to wrap things up and I'm going to say the usual. If you're not subbed already, please drop me a sub. Give me a bummy thumbs up if you feel that way inclined. And of course, tap the bell icon and the all icon to get any future notifications whatsoever. And again, guys, if you love emulation and retro game systems, I've got a perfect group for you on Facebook. Is the Retro Emulation and Consoles fan group. With 5,000 members plus, guys, you cannot go wrong. There is just a ton of content from system unboxing, system reviews, emulation performance, tech help videos, and a whole lot more and the world's greatest admin team to boot. So guys, if you love all that, linked below, head over, we'd love to see you. And then guys, I also have my UK Crap Gaming Facebook group as well, where we cover everything gaming, from the dawn of gaming with Pong machines, right the way through to PS5 and everything that came in between. And again, ever-growing member base, fantastic content because other YouTubers put their videos up there every single day. And again, guys, just a wonderful place to banter, and love everything about gaming throughout the generations. So if that floats your boat, that is also linked below. Then guys, finally, I have my channel membership. For as little as 99 pence a month, you can become a member of the UK Crowd family. This will give you access to the members only videos. It will also get you a badge next to your name in the comments that changes color every month. And let's everybody know that you are indeed a member of the UK Crowd family. There is other tiers of other perks attached guys. So if you just find that join button, Head over and see what you think. And with that, guys, I'm going to love you and leave you and see our videos in. Tschüss and goodbye. And I'll see you in the next one, guys. Bye-bye.